yo, yo, what's up, guys? Be by Haiti and Yen. Today, we're going to be making a chill beat from scratch, like an out there kind of vibe, you know? So, yeah, let's just go straight into it. So, first of all, we want to set our BPM to like 100 BPM, and let's what it sounds like. Yeah, I like, I like the. So, we're going to be using a sound from Omnisphere, and yeah, I like this sound, Pluck Lo Fi, and it's from the Wave Supply. Um. <laughs> Let's add a little bit of uh, um, a delay. Yeah. So let's try to find a sound that we can lay out to the left and to the right. Yeah, I think I like this. So let's bring this down. Let's pan this to the right and drag this down because they're playing similar thing. And this is like what I do every time when I make beats. So I just like to increase the millisecond. Yeah, like. Yeah, and of course, gonna add a sound from my pack, um, Hessian, I tell one shot, and I'm gonna be adding my favorite mallet, which is the vibraphone, so. So let's try to bring in a sound from um Ake. This is gonna be like a simple bounce, you know? Okay, so I'm just playing something real quick and this is what it sounds like. I think I like that. So let's just drop that below. I think I like the... Woo! I, love, I like this. Ooh, I like this. So we want to start adding our drum at this point because we're just trying to make a simple Ote Afrobeat vibe. So I'm going to go into my Haitian Attack Kit Volume 3 and let's look for a nice snare. So I like this, so let's put that in, you know. Normal simple bounce. Yeah. So let's try to layer that with another snare. I think I like this solid one, so let's play that under. So. Yeah. So at this point, let's add in like a nice hi-hat to like give it a little bit of bounce. So let's use the um, Maza hi-hat. I think I like that one. So we're going to do like the normal. So what I'm just doing, I'm just basically putting this hi-hat in a position where there's no other sounds, like there's no other snare coming in. So, you know, just for it to fill up that space. So that's just what I'm basically doing. That's my thought process while I'm adding in this hi-hat. You can notice where it enters, there's no sound there. See? So let's just go straight to um, Essie Ataki. Let's drop in a nice kick. So we'll drop this real quick and. <laughs> yeah, I like the. Drop a dip, drop a dip, drop a dip. Like the way you give me Zani Gonza. So let's add in a bass. I'm going to go to my Hissian Ataki shot one kit and I'm going to play in like my favorite bass, which is the distorted sub bass. So let's add that real quick and we're just going to be following the um the chord progressions. So I think I like that. So let's just play that real quick. Let's take up the instrument. Uh, uh, yeah, you know, to get the vibe. What we're going to do to, in order to make this bass to glide is to go over to controls, then on the glide, and let's let's try to play around and come up with something. Don't think 
too much while you're making your beats just relax and enjoy yourself so and uh, while we're putting the glide what we do is just simply use the octave of each note so like for this one i'm just going to play it uh, play it around the side and so yeah Yeah, you see? I think I like the... Woo! I think I like this alien vibe. So I like what this is sounding like. Uh, yeah, really cool. So at this point, you can start to like arrange the beat and just a real quick arrangement. Start it with something really nice. So we can start with this, put the vocals around this side, you know, to spice it up and... Yeah, we can start with that. Uh, and we can give it a break around this side, then quickly bring in the drums and, you know, that's how this vibe should be, so... <laughs> I think I like the. So one thing we can also do is add in the nice um shaker loop, you know. Yeah, this is not. So on this side. We can now bring in the chorus. This is now like where every sound comes in, you know, the whole vibe, the everything around the side. And we can duplicate this one up to this side. Just a quick arrangement of what the beat should sound like. So on this first part, what we can do is add like simple um bass just to differentiate the verse to the chorus so let's start to add simple bass pattern to the verse so we can just like loop that loop this right here uh, simple And for this um, vocal over here, what we can also do today is go to the audio, add in some delays to like make the vocal have some kind of effect, you know? So let's start from the top. So yeah, I took my time and I had to come up with the vocals. I'm going to play the chorus. This is what the chorus sounds like for now. Yeah, that's like basically what I have and this is what the vocal is going to sound like. So all I can do is to probably come back to it another day and walk towards it. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. If this was um creative enough and you learned one or two things, please make sure you leave a like. That's what encourages me to do more video. Leave a like, drop a, drop a comment and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Remember to stay positive and positive things always happen to you. Peace.
my strength. 